Hi, and welcome to Table Talks on Today with Paul. Today, I'm happy to share with you an unboxing of a, a parcel I just received in the mail a couple days ago. I've been very anxious to open this, and uh, I thought I would share uh, an unboxing with you on this show. Uh, previously, I've, I've actually uh, taken out of the box a couple action figures on a uh, articulated comic book art uh, show of Today with Paul, but today I'm actually going to see what the heck is inside this box right here. Uh, we're going to see if it's exactly what I ordered, which was a uh, Voyager class G1 Megatron from China, Shanghai, China, in fact, and so I'll go ahead and give you a nice little shot of the label there. Authentic, nice postage out of Japan, international USPS, I believe, and also what looks to be quite the beat up box here. First, we're gonna end up seeing <laughs> uh, if I got the right thing and if it's in any sort of shape <laughs> to be excited about. Uh, look at all this tape. They made sure that this thing was not going to be opened or come loose for nothing. I mean, <laughs> uh, bought this uh, off of eBay, through eBay rather, uh, and and so my first time buying what would be considered more so a generic uh, version of some sort of quality action figure. Uh, for a very decent price, uh, $39.99 for this guy. And uh, I've got some assistance here with this uh, Kershaw Emerson today. A uh, little uh, Kershaw and the brand Emerson Knife Company. They uh, collaborated on this um, nice little design here. It's kind of neat. You got a little disc there for the thumb side opener. But we're going to go ahead and crack this box open and see what we got. I think I'm going to start from the bottom here where I see this, this little crease up here. It looks like the knife will go in there just nice. Yeah, there we go. It's looking good so far. A very sharp blade, by the way. Fairly cool design, in my opinion. Um, yeah, very sharp. Okay, let's see if we can get this. Nah, we're not going to play with that side. Let's see. Ever so gently get down the side here on this one, maybe. Mm. I don't want I don't want to destroy what's inside. But when I'm oh there we go. Okay, that uh, looks like this top. There. Okay. All that tape. And they definitely bubble wrap this very nicely. So. <laughs> it looks like it might be worth the squeeze. We're going to find out here though, aren't we? So welcome to a little adventure on Today with Paul. Uh, I'm, don't worry, I'm going to close that knife when, when I feel it's necessary. Uh, yeah, we're going to need a little bit more help with this guy, I think. Um, man, they got this thing packed tight. Of course, some of the dents on the outside didn't help, did it? Oh, man. Came to hardly get this thing out of the package. All right, I think I see a little snag there. That's what I'm seeing. Yep, just a little snag there. Okay, maybe, maybe now. Yeah, we're not catching on nothing now. Oh yeah. <laughs> Safety first. Let's close this puppy. Uh, as sharp as it is, I'm not playing around with the accidents. Um, already you can see where there's a nice display of Megatron on the front of this box inside of all this bubble wrap. Um, box is about as beat up as the other one, so let's see here. It looks like I got a nice little, yeah, flap of, uh, you know, they folded it all nice and stuff. We're going to go ahead and bring that knife out again for some assistance here. Nice deployment too, by the way, pretty, pretty smooth with that disc uh, instead of the Typical little uh, uh, thumb studs. Yeah, that's what they're doing. Alright, let's go ahead and get the other side here. Yeah, get this bubble wrap off. We want to see what's inside.
almost like Christmas. <laughs> oh yeah, they got this puppy wrapped tight. There we go. Paleo fishing. There we go, nice. Okay, so here we go. The nice graphics on the box, I like that. Uh, you get this uh, on the side. Here on the back it shows his transformation and also his accessories. On the side here, there you go. Um, what does it say? It says, uh, uh, mechanic, mechanic masters. I, I, I don't know exactly how to pronounce that. I almost want to say mechanic, but that's not it. Uh, here's some little information on the bottom if you like. There you go. Um, let's go ahead and get this puppy open. Uh, looks like, oh, okay, that was a very cheap piece of tape right there. We're going to go ahead and close this bad boy and set to the side. In fact, because now we're in business, let's go ahead and open this up and see what we get. Okay, toss that to the side. Um, right off the bat, we get this nice little pamphlet uh, showing uh, Megatron in all his glory and uh, his robot form and also uh, his transformation mode but just so happens to be a hand pistol <laughs> uh, old school for the 80s uh, oh boy you know <laughs> I'm sure that caused some trouble amongst uh, uh, the parents and or the law enforcement even I mean it looked pretty cool though uh, all these instructions on transformation and there you go on that um, go ahead yeah I'll show you what we got here here we go, here's Megatron in all his glory. There's everything included, everything looks good. I don't see anything damaged, uh, that sort of thing. I'll take this cover off. There's a nice shot of everything in there. Oh, yeah, I thought that tip might fall out. That's a regular pistol tip, and there goes a, a nice little other accessory. But. But you can see how they, yeah, there it all goes. <laughs> well, anyways, besides all that, you can see it was barely press fit plastic. No twisty ties as uh, a lot of folks expect. Um, yeah, you know, you get what you pay for. And uh, there's Megatron. I'm not going to try to do a, a transformation on him right now. I'm going to take my time and patience and, and, and do my best to... Uh, go ahead and do that on my own time. I'm gonna pick him up for now though and uh, show him off as it were. And so here you go. There's Megatron. He's a little bit wonky right now. We'll figure it all out. Uh, who knows, maybe even a shameless product placement. But for right now, I wanna thank you for sharing, liking, and subscribing. And I hope to catch you next time. Peace.